With nearly a decade of camper manufacturing experience, Blue Water have really drilled down the details in this latest issue of the popular Macquarie. Within a minute of first looking through this camper, it's attention to detail in the build process that impresses first up. How do you improve on a good thing? It's an interesting question, and it's one that Blue Water have answered by improving an already top spec standard. One touch operation, Improving hallmark innovations like the snake track drag train system so that you now have all your services bundled up neatly. No stuffing about with gas connectivity. I can set a billy to boil within a minute of parking. Another class leading attribute of the Macquarie is its tented interior. The canvas, the frames, the zip quality are second to none. The queen bed area and the dinette are as good as it gets. But the real luxury are these supersized windows. The picture frame views, the gentle breezes, all bring the atmosphere of a beautiful campsite indoors. And really, isn't that what it's all about? But let's see what the judges have to say. The Blue Water Macquarie Ford Fold really up standards this year. What did you make of it, Bear? Oh, I mean, it really was a big footprint with a really well presented camper that was just so well thought out. You get a five year suspension, structural, chassis warranty, and five years is pretty good, and this is probably as good as anything you're gonna get in the industry. You get a three year warranty on the water pump and the water system, five years on the canvas. They're obviously doing it because they're confident they've got a great product. I like the roominess and openness of this, and the Macquarie really makes use of that with big windows all the way around. It really has a, a nice roominess about it. Yeah, I really, really liked the Macquarie Forward Fold and I was impressed by the, some of the smaller details. The one-handed fridge latch slide was really great. Watching the setup and everything, it was really quick. I love the way they've just gone through and looked at every little aspect of it and said, how can I improve on this? Rather than saying, oh, near enough's good enough. And so that willingness to adapt and to constantly improve and refine, I think, really shows in the finished product. I found it really easy to tow. It sort of followed the car really nicely and, you know, it handled all the tracks that we took it on really well. So you've got good stock standard sort of componentry and top of the range componentry, Ron. It towed well and all those sorts of things and, yeah, the attention to detail, the base model, you know, where they started off from and what they've added to it. It's just made a really good package, I reckon. And they've got the storage space as well, which made a bit of a difference. You've got power and you've got water, they're the two key components for living in the bush. You've got plenty of both, you've got two 120 AGMs, solar, the whole lock, stock and barrel. You can certainly live off the grid for a while, that's for sure with it. It is a pretty impressive payload, about 900 kilos. That's a hell of a lot of goodies you can stuff into the camper, that's for sure. Yeah, I think it's really good value for money. Yeah, given, given what you get for it, I mean 35 grand's a lot of money. But for what you get, it just ticks all the boxes. You're not going to have to go out and then spend extra money adding things. It's the whole package is there. The bottom line is I don't have to even talk about how good a value for money it is because they're selling plenty of them. So let the market speak for themselves. It seems Blue Water have managed to improve on an already excellent camper with this latest issue Macquarie.